Hey, welcome back. So this is where we left off last episode at this awkward train. See how we handle the situation. Is there any way to get around it? Doesn't look like it. On foot, maybe. Can't really afford to do that now. This seems like a safe area. Well, this brush will stop anything from creeping up on us. And I'd like everyone out of the RV except her. I don't want folks trapped in there with her. Why don't you and I go look around? Yeah, everyone else relax. Clearly. Stay close to Kenny and Cat, okay? Lee, if you come across anything to drink, uh, if there's a dining car or something, I think Duck's a bit dehydrated. It's a freighter, hon. Be careful in there. What? You think there might be something dangerous inside an abandoned locomotive? That would cross my mind. Yeah, it kind of crossed mine. Doors closed. So, but this looks recently used. Be on the lookout and have your guard up. The clipboard. A map of where the train goes. I think these tracks might lead to the coast. Route 27, Savannah. That's where Kinney's got us headed. Looks unopened. I'll take this to Katja for Duck. Might as well give him the water now. He's allergic to bees. Is that right? That's all I can keep thinking about. Like, somehow that matters. It doesn't. I know. Well, I don't. But you're probably right. We found this in the boxcar back there. Whoa, is this what it looks like? I think so. These tracks lead right to Savannah. Holy hell. Can you guys see about moving that thing? We could have something here. Yeah, we're on it. Hey, Clem. What are you going to do with Lily? I don't know. Something, I suppose. I don't know what we can do. She killed him. Yeah, it, it's horrible. Killed the bitch? I don't know. Left her? I've never seen anybody kill someone like that before. Can't believe she did it either. Seen a bunch of other stuff by now. Yeah, but not like that. You uh happy you stayed with us all this time? Yeah. Really? It's with you guys or dead. I would have died out there in the woods. Just like my classmates. You think this is better? Yeah, of course. Was it you? Not this again. Was it? 
No! Okay, then. Well, he said it wasn't him, so... Might be something inside. something inside. Busted shut, but nice and heavy. Might be something inside. It's like a head buster. Oh god, oh god, don't... No! Oh. Okay. Just the engine. Oh god. Suppose we ought to look him over. Yeah. Wow, someone already killed him. And he had family? I don't think this guy came back. Christ. That light is blinking. Push it. Push it? Why not? Are you fucking serious? Here, look. It's just the brakes. Okay, I'll give you that one. This fucker works? Seems like it. I'll be damned. How the hell do we get it moving? I don't know. That's Mr. Amtrak over here. No clue. Well, let's look. This guy around. nonchalantly pulls the body like out the train. Man, if you could keep an eye on the girls and duck, I'd appreciate it. I'm gonna make sense of these controls. Man, this could be exactly what we need. He had family. Shit, this is it. Instructions on starting the engine. Damn, pages are gone. I can kind of see the indentations from the writing. I have 
no idea what to do with these. I have no idea. Okay, I guess touching them is bad. What is that over there? It's a bunch of papers. Those might be useful. A bunch of maps about Georgia cities. Nothing about the train. What is this? Ugh. I think I made sense of those restrictions. There's a notepad on the train. Do you have any pencils or anything in your pack? No, I wish. Maybe in the RV. What do you need it for? There used to be something written on the notepad that I need to know about. Well, if you're not using it, I'd take it. I'm out of paper, and there's all sorts of new leaves around here. Sitting here tied up like an animal while you guys decide what to do with me. It's not like that. Then what's it like? Uh. Oh, I didn't mean to leave. No. Gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. I'm leaving. Don't move. Don't you fucking move. I'm not going to hurt you. Come with me. We could take the RV right now. He left the keys in it. No way! Didn't think you would say yes. I can't let you take the RV. Don't be crazy. You're not letting me take it. Sorry, Lee. I really am. Oh, what a bitch. Holy shit! She's stealing the RV! Lily! Come back here, you crazy bitch! Fuck! Stop! Let's focus on the train. Well, we're fucked if we don't figure out how this thing works. Can't spend the night out here. Duck is still sick, you know. We need to get to the city, the coast. It's one hell of a mess. I feel like Duck is going to kill someone. Read it now? Yeah. Should be able to just follow the steps to get the engine on. Sounds good.
down, up. up. This is like the most retarded engine setup I've ever seen in my life. Oh god. So what? Two down, two up, up, down, up. Crit it straight. Turn, turn, over. And where are all these located? Down. I gotta check this again. I, I can't even remember what's on the paper. Down, down. Up. 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 Didn't mean to hit that button. Son of a bitch! Whatever you did, lit the dash up. So far, so good. Okay, for five, five. All right. Now we're talking. Oh, I didn't mean to go out the door. No. Where's nine at? I don't see nine. Six five nine is where? Oh, is nine the engine startup out here? Compartment. Yep, oh, found it. So first is right. Then left. left then right holy shit we're golden this thing is loud so what we're barreling down the tracks at 40 miles an hour I don't care about the noise Let's fucking enjoy this. Mom, let's see if she'll move. It's all yours. That's the throttle. Still attached. Can you go find out where we're stuck and get us unstuck? Yeah.
gonna be a better way to do this. There. Hey, Kenny, we're loose. Touch any of my stuff. Oh shit. I didn't take anything. I asked if you touched it. I didn't. I guess it's no worse for wear. Name's Chuck. Charles, if you fancy. Lee. Is that your crew outside? Yeah. And the guy up in the cab. Him, too. I saw you walking through here and thought about scaring the pants off you. What? But I couldn't force myself to do it. You're still kind of <laughs> freaking me out. Train folk will do that. Already met everyone outside. They all warmed to me right quick in direct sunlight. Wow, this guy just creeps around. Chuck. Yeah, I did. It's so nice to meet someone normal for a change. He gave us candy, Ben too. What's your game, man? Keeping alive. That's not bad. I like it. You met Kenny? Sure did. Man shares my love of the road. That's for certain. <coughs> I'm awful sorry your son's not feeling good. I appreciate your concern. Well, with a little TLC, I'm sure he'll be fit as a fiddle in no time. And I can offer y'all whatever I got, although it ain't much. Thank you. We'd like to do the same. Why don't we hold off on the... Stay with us. We'd like the company. Lost one and gain one more. Awesome. Hey, Chuck. Howdy. Where are you from? You live around here? Georgia boy. You saw where I live. Why are you alone? Why not? Seem to be doing all right. Fine, then. I'm sorry. I do like being around y'all, actually. It's nice. You caught us on a bad day. Mm. You still got a couple of kids. And this one's got a good spirit. That's some kind of something. I'll talk to you later. Hope so. Man, is he going to turn anytime soon? How stuff? Which could mean a lot of things, right? Yeah. His body's probably fighting whatever's in it. Exactly. Has Clementine said anything to you about Doug or Duck or anything? I'm worried about him. No. That little girl is a puzzle. Yeah, she is. Poor Doug. God, where did yesterday go? I don't know. You were standing right there. Are you doing okay? I'm fine. It's just such a waste. He was a good guy. I liked him very much. He'd spent some time in Belgium. Where your family's from? Yes. Even further away now. I'm sorry about the RV. I'm worried. We're really on our own out here now. Yeah, we 
and putting some time into this train. Worst comes to worse, boxcar safe enough yep. to sleep in. Anyway, let me know if anything changes here. So I get everyone onto this train here. Hey, sweet pea, that candy Chuck gave you, it taste okay? It was really good. No funny aftertaste? No. Train's cool, huh? I guess. Scary, kind of. How you doing, Ben? I'm watching the girls and not working on a mega cool train. What do you think? Oh, prick. So that's it? We're cut loose? Seems that way, yeah. Great. We don't got much left, so just gather whatever you have. Wanna ride? Well, it sounds like you're taking my home. That's a yes, then. And find anything better for keeping the creepy crawlies out than that boxcar. Duck's sick. Get on the train, Clementine. Uh oh. He's getting sicker. Let me look at it. We can't ignore this. Look at the kid, Kenny. This is happening. Ain't shit. Oh, hypocrite. And if hypocrite. It were, what can we do here? We get on the train and we find something better. That is the plan. I think Lee just wants to talk it through. It's talked through. Get on, Kent. I'll be up front. I don't want to hear any nonsense until we get where we're going. Well, this looks like where I'm going to end this episode. Uh, I would like to thank you guys for watching. Once again, I made this one pretty long because I didn't post one last night. And I was pretty excited to see this when I got home. So, what I need you guys to do if you want to see more is comment, like, subscribe, and even favorite because every bit helps. Thanks, guys.